Okay, this one is going to be for Aquarius and it's for um, October 2015. And we have Night of Air, which is a very type of energy that can be really quite Aquarian. You're intelligent, you're decisive, you're feeling idealistic and certainly tireless. Events that occur with great speed, say, you're going to be taking time to carefully review your options and creative solutions will be there for you. And you can see the light on the unicorn is really um, <clears throat> showing that these creative solutions will light the way forward. Your challenge is to really shine like the sun, you know, like this. You know, you're, 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 you're seeing the creative solutions, but you're not being the creative solutions yet, but you will be, but it's just a little bit of a challenge to be, to show and to shine all your intelligence. Mm -hmm. but there will be a happy outcome when you do. Um, you've got these brilliant new ideas that are going to lead to success. And you just need to have confidence in yourself. Ultimately, the background to this is something to do with memories from your history of childhood. Issues regarding children or romanticising the past. You're wanting to do things that are fair and just in terms of your decisions. You know what to do. Um, you've been doing what is right and you've been standing up for your beliefs, basically. So you've been standing up for them, but there's something kind of about actually following them through that you're, you're needing to kind of fall through as well. And it might just be some sort of structural influences at the moment. However, it's showing that it's certainly a time of positive change and a situation suddenly is going to move forward. Fortune is on your side. This is one of the best cards ever. And you've got that for what's coming up. That's really great, Aquarius. So we also have, oh, wow, amazing number seven, the chariot. Your um, real strengths right now are that you're making important, ach important achievements. You've got self-discipline and willpower. And there's certainly some sort of public recognition and whatever you're doing and you are making time for those around you you're taking sensible approaches and dealing with any challenges in a kind and understanding manner this could also be someone around you as well that could be doing this it could be really showing signs of being the queen of earth they're thoughtful creative warm and sensible and they're in your life just now and they're maybe taking lots of time with you either way you do have some hopes and fears surrounding this area, which is a nine of earth, enjoying life's little luxuries, spending quiet time alone, successful self-employment. I think maybe just being on your own and having enjoying your own time, you have some sort of um, fears or also hopes surrounding this. It's like you want to, but maybe you haven't really done that before. So it's something definitely there that's lingering in the background. And it is showing that there will be good news on its way regarding financial matters and wanting to do something more challenging, a new area of study, which might see you 